Hey, this is Gary Kay. We are here at Infocom 2019, and we're doing two things at the same time. We're doing a live booth tour on LinkedIn with Gavin Downey, Senior Product Manager at Epson. Good morning, Gavin. How are you? Good morning, Gary. Good to see you. The other thing we're doing is we're recording this, so if you want to see all the videos we are shooting here live at Infocom 2019, go to raypubs.com slash Infocom 2019. Epson always has one of the most impressive booths. We're going to show you what, what they're showing. This is going to be a live tour of the show, live, right? And we're going to show you what you're missing by not being here at the show. But the first most impressive thing is native 4K right here in its giant glory. Thanks, Gary. Yeah, it's an exciting Infocom 2019 for us at Epson. We've got both our highest resolution uh, projector that we've ever launched. It's a native 4K, 12,000 lumen projector in portrait mode. So what we're really doing is inviting uh, people to come up and see the incredible resolution. So you can walk right up to the screen and just see the incredible detail. So not only large scale imagery, brilliant three LCD color, but very high resolution. So our highest resolution projector we've ever made. Yes, that's native 4K right there, highest resolution projector ever from Epson. And Epson is the largest and most successful projector manufacturer in the world with 3LCD. So this is going to be a bellwether for the, the entire 3LCD industry, don't you think? I think so. I think so. I mean, we're really excited to show it here. We've had incredible uh, response so far to folks that we've talked to about it. And what are we showing here? Because I see that you have, uh, is this two? Two Pro L three thousand uh, thirty thousands or three thousands. I forget the model. Uh, that's okay. Uh, yeah. So what we're showing is this is the highest resolution projector that we just talked about, and this is the brightest projector that Epson has ever launched. So it's the new Pro L thirty thousand. So we've got two thirty thousands pixel stack. So uh, almost sixty thousand lumens. Uh, All right. So that's two Pro L thirty thousand. So that's sixty thousand lumens. You can see the projectors up there right there they're stacked but but Epson is always famous for doing something wild on the show floor something fun on the show floor sure. and you did not disappoint this year so I want the camera to point over there and tell us a little bit about what you're what we're gonna see when we go in that room sure so it's an incredible art piece it's called Ecoterica and it's really all about the natural world. And we're using 15,000 lumen projectors that run on standard power and ultra short throw lenses and this sort of sheen fabric from Rosebrand. And it provides incredible contrast. Speed. You can actually see through the fabric and there's a slight time delay. So you've got imagery uh, coming at you. So it's a uh, very immersive. Uh, when you walk by the panels, they are triggered and video starts to play and actually audio is augmented so you can see uh, you can see what's happening and hear what's happening as you're interacting with the piece. All right, so what I'm going to ask the camera person to do, our videographer here, yeah. is as I'm walking backwards and hopefully don't get nailed by somebody behind me, is to walk through it and just let the people experience it for a second. So for 30 seconds, just walk through it and let them experience it on their own. Kind of a nice piece and just to walk. Right here is a really nice uh, on-axis way of viewing it, and you'll notice that the content is uh, is moving, right? And you can actually see through the panels. So what you're so so basically, if you look carefully, you can see through the panels, and you see multiple projected images that are at about a they're being projected at about 160 degrees, I would guess, off-axis because you're using your special th short throw lens. That's right. So it's kind of interesting, Gary, as you can walk around the side and there's no shadows because as you pointed out, right, it's, it's an extreme angle off of this ultra short throw. So you can go right up to the image. All right. So walk through the entire thing. Just do a quick loop through the entire thing. And uh, we're going to we're going to kind of do a quick tour of the rest of the booth because you've got a lot of stuff here at. Infocom 2019 and the best way to see it is to actually watch all the videos we're actually going to shoot individual videos at each one of the product stations here uh, so you have a chance to see everything yeah we're really excited about uh, the partnership with rave this year in terms of not only the booth tours but um, other assets that we're creating together so allow people to really experience it yeah we're actually going to do um, shoot individual videos as I said uh, at every single one of these product stations and you can see them by going to uh, raypubs.com slash infocom 2019 typing in Epson in the video search window but we're also going to do a VR experience of the entire booth so about a week after the show you're going to be able to do an entire tour of this of this booth with a VR headset and it's going to be compatible with any VR headset on the market 
Yeah, it was, we uh, worked with you at DSC and we, we received incredible uh, response, not only from customers, but from our own salespeople that really enjoyed, that couldn't make it to the, to the show, uh, really enjoyed learning about the exhibits at the show and they actually use it with their customers. So it's been, it's been very successful. So in this case, we're going to do a booth about 10 times the size of DSC. <laughs> So it's going to be harder to do, but it's going to be fun. So let's quickly run through and look at what else is here on the show floor. Obviously, um, the you have a new Brightlink uh, projector line as well. I just wrote up a story about that. Yeah, so a brand new form factor for Brightlink. So incredibly slim. Uh, you'll notice it has an ultra short throw lens and a form factor very similar to our large venue form factor and an incredible 16-6 um, aspect ratio. So in very, very uh, wide, and that's a multimedia interactive surface. So it's a massive surface that you can drag files onto, multimedia files, you can use it as a whiteboard simultaneously. So it's just a huge workspace. Yeah, it's, it's sort of like you've got uh, digital ideation uh, built into this, but it's interactive. And, uh, and, and is this aimed at both the corporate and the education market? Yeah, we see it used extensively in corporate training. Um, we even use uh, similar form factors in um, non-interactive digital signage. So uh, obviously very uh, good applications in K through 12, but people are really migrating to, as these get brighter and smaller, and they're ultra short throws. So you got four or 5,000 lumens just uh, a foot away from the screen. They're very, very bright. So they can knock down a bunch of ambient light and they're interactive. So people are using them in entirely new ways. All right, so one thing that I think surprised people was that Epson would even go to a digital signage show because everyone thinks of digital signage as being flat panel based, right? And uh, But yet you surprised everybody this year's DSE show with your light scene products and showing how projectors can be used in signage applications. And you've got a great setup here explaining that. We do. So, I mean, what we have here, it's really, we really view the market not so much in terms of digital signage, but digital experiences. So a lot of uh, companies are looking to create experiences both in uh, traditional retail space, maybe even a public space. We're talking about projection mapping and artwork. So this is a 12 by 18 foot surface pixel mapped with two 15,000 lumen projectors and you've got a camera so when you step into these squares the content actually responds to your presence. And, and the squares by the way are being projected by uh, light scenes. That's aren't right, they? that's yeah. right. So light scenes really kind of mass. You don't really see it because you think of it as almost like uh, track lighting. Yeah, so, so the, quite magical. Yeah, in fact the light scene is a track lighting based projector. If we can move over here that's and right. see it. It fits on a track lighting system here. It comes in black or white it's laser based projector and uh, it's 3 LCD 1280 by uh, 800 resolution if I remember correctly um, and uh, it's it's a laser based product and it literally fits on a track lighting system and it's being used for digital signage application in fact this wall here all the imagery here is being generated by the projector and it's being image mapped to each of the devices that you have here on the wall just to sort of show an example of how you can use it uh, in sort of a retail or a restaurant environment. That's right. I mean, uh, we've got seven light scenes mapped onto the wall in uh, various ways. So it's both highlighting things like vases, it's providing information, it's providing sort of like digital artwork. So a very broad array of different applications for light scene. And again, it really blends in with the uh, trust. You can't really see what's going on there. Yeah, and, and, and the design is intentional because since it is laser, you can go 360 degrees. You can basically throw the light any way you want. Yep. You're, you're not you're not required to just stay horizontal, vertical, portrait, or landscape mode. You can basically throw light any direction, any angle. That's right. It's, it's laser, right? So it's laser-based. So orientation is virtually irrelevant, right? So. so they have 16, I think you said, product stations here in the booth. So there's no way we're going to be able to do all these on a, quick, on a quick tour. But what I want you to do is immediately after watching this tour right here is go to raypubs.com slash infocom2019, type in Epson in the video search window. We're going to shoot videos on all of these products because you've got a bunch of new products here at Infocom 2019. I know we didn't cover everything, but uh, large venue, education projectors, corporate projectors, uh, digital signage projectors. Did I miss anything that you want to get into this tour? I think you hit it all, Gary. It's good to see you. It's great to see you, Gavin. I appreciate you doing this. i just looking around. All I'm, I'm surrounded by imagery here. Ultra short throw lens for the Pro-L 1000 series here is, is amazing. I mean, this is just beautiful. It's a brand new Pro-L 1000 series. So it's 9,000 lumens, and what we're showing it here with the XO2 lens and a screen innovation screen, and it just really pops quite beautifully. It's uh, optimized for ultra short throw. Yeah, and uh, this is just one example of what you're going to see here in the in the booth. 
I want to thank everyone for joining us, especially those of you on LinkedIn Live. I know this is kind of an unusual experience, kind of overwhelming with all the stuff here. But Gavin Downey, congratulations on a great show. Thanks for joining us today, and uh, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day. All of our Infocom coverage is at raypubs.com.